Well, hello and welcome to the Intuitive Message channel. They call me Mitchell and this is your energy forecast and intuitive message for today, Sunday, December the 6th, 2015. And as always, thank you for taking time to retweet, post, subscribe, become a fan, support me on patreon.com financially and share this message, especially when you feel like someone can use it. I love it when I see someone tag somebody and share it with them or just tag them and just let it go. See if they even listen to it. So thanks for showing up today. And the message is this. Simple is not the same as easy. So many times the answers in our lives, the things, the beliefs, relationship problems, work stuff, it's usually simple. The answer is usually simple. Does not mean it's easy, you know? You know, living a, a spiritual life is pretty simple. Does not mean it's gonna be easy. So today, look for where the things, answers, you know, solutions are gonna be simple but not necessarily easy. And I think sometimes we can make them easier if we don't fight them by realizing the simplicity of them. So I think by realizing it, and that's going back to a lot of that, you know, the wisdom erases karma from Dick Sutphin, you know, knowing what is, is going to help you move forward in an easier way. Um, resisting the, the change makes it difficult, you know. So go with the flow and make it a little easier on yourself. And it probably is a lot more simple than you think. There's your message. So cards, numbers, um, what else? You know, energy for today. Lenormand is going to be, today the sixth is going to be the cross. So this is about burden. This is about your belief system. This can be about, you know, a cross to bear, a, you know, just a difficult thing, a suffering, a misfortune. You know, um, it can be about religion because it is a religious object for many, 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 many people. And terror to go along with that cross is going to be the tower. So for me, I would say today's the day to dismantle your belief system. Today is the day to release that burden, to just drop it, let it crash to the ground. This is truly an example of it's simple, but it may not be easy. It's simple, but it may not be easy. And then today's energy, all the numbers add up to eight, which is about self-mastery. You know, eight is authority, power, success, material wealth. You know, so there could be even some energy of letting the material stuff go today. Because um, oftentimes the cross represents, you know, a simplified life of material stuff as well. Not always, but it can. Depends on you. So today may be the day that you just let everything drop and crash to the ground, especially what you believe, the burdens you've been carrying, and uh, move forward. Tomorrow, the seventh day of the month of December, the Lenormand is going to be the key. So the key, as Rana George says, is the most beautiful, wonderful card in the Lenormand deck. It's powerful, it's positive. It is the key, it is the answer, it is the solution. We're just talking about that, um, the keys and solution. Uh, and you know, this could be just revelations, because sometimes, again, wisdom may just be the thing you need, just the knowing what is, the awareness of what is. So to go along with the key, Tara, we're bringing the king of swords. So your answer may be, Stepping into your King of Swords energy, that is the very logical, mathematical, accounting, engineer, personality types there are. They are the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius people, usually men and women. But the King of Swords is a very dynamic, very masculine man. He's a thinker. He's a judge. He's a juror. He's a police officer. He's that detective, engineer, mathematician. You know, so the key may be using your logic. And then the energy for tomorrow is number nine. It's It's got a little bit of seven energy because the day is seven. Analytical, research, solitude, spiritual focus. So some of that. But I think more than anything, it's about the number nine, which is the ending transformation. Moving things on to a better place, you know, Per number it's the number of perfection number nine is perfect number of perfection so and 33 3 plus 3 is 6 but 3 times 3 is 9 so I like that energy there so there is your message for today and tomorrow so thank you for those of you who showed up at Kissimmee New World Wellness Yoga Studio yesterday I appreciate you being there and um, I've got my um, shocker class today 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time we've got one more after today today's third eye next week is crown chakra you can always go to the wellnessuniverse.com and find this um, series of webinars that Kim Bain and I have done through the Wellness Universe and you can purchase that and watch all the past episodes and issues of that. 
So what else? Check out my website if you feel led, intuitivemitchell.com. I got readings available, in-person, FaceTime, Skype, phone sessions. You know, we can do phone um, anywhere in the U.S., Canada, Puerto Rico, FaceTime, and Skype around the globe. Um, so namaste. Talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.